time. And um, I thank you, Tom, for coming. Uh, I sorry we have to start over again, but that's okay. I, I repeat a lot of times. Now, uh, when did you become president of the Golden yeah. Rain Foundation? I was elected to president in June of the year 2000. Mm -hmm. And uh, so you have two years, yes. almost. In. Almost, yes, almost two years. And you're allowed to serve? Uh, you're allowed to serve three one-year terms, mm -hmm. and you have to take at least a year off if we can serve again as president. Okay. Now, who preceded you as uh, president? Uh, Mildred Tuttle preceded me as a president. She had been president for three years. Mm -hmm. um, you have no idea who's going to follow you? No, we'll have to let, let fate decide that. <laughs> okay. Uh, what were your past positions and present positions uh, on the board? Before I came to the Golden Rain Board in 1997, I was president of Mutual 15 for two years. Then after I came on the Golden Rain Board, I was uh, in 1998 president, a uh, chairman of the medical committee. And then in the year 1999, I was uh, vice president of the Golden Rain Board. And you did a wonderful job of Mutual 15, too. It was really a fun job. Yeah. And, and really, I think the biggest thing in 15 was the elevators, right? Well, actually the lights, too. The lights. I'm, I'm well, most, the most lights, proud yes. of the lights. Yes, I remember I got lost in 15 one time. <laughs> uh, we thank you for all those things. Um, and you represent Mutual 15. Correct, right? I mean, Mutual 15 on the board. Okay. How old are you? Do you I'm, I'm uh, 63 now, and uh, so I was 62 when I was elected to the presidency. Mm -hmm. You're still a baby, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> How old were you when... I was... Uh, oh, well, oh, wait a minute. This is superfluous, I'm asking you, because this is for former uh, non-active president, so we'll forget that. Okay. Um, uh, what accomplishments of the board are you most proud? Well, I think the one I'm most proud of is the, is the new medical center. I think that was done before I was on the board primarily, but I was here towards the last of it. Uh, and I was as, as a strong supporter as a mutual president. Then I think another thing that I'm very proud of is, is the, that we now have the administrator who is an employee of, of the Golden Rain Foundation rather than being an outside contractor. I think that gives the board a great deal more control over day-to-day -day operations of the, uh, the op operations of the, the community. Those are probably the two two best best things I think. And also, I'm very proud of, of the lights, which started out in Mutual 15, the new pole lights, which are now almost throughout the entire community. I think that's probably one of the things. It's nice to see an idea started in one place, which grew throughout the whole community. Yes, and um, you have you do attend all the meetings, don't you? Yes, I do. All all, all the committee meetings and uh, as well as the board meetings. Mm -hmm. um, what are your outstanding memories of time and uh, moments? Any I, any embarrassing moments? Any great moments? No, I think that the thing that re I really remember best is is the uh, thing that happened while Mrs. Tuttle was president, and that was the Millennium Celebration. I think that was a, a really a good example of the whole community coming together for three hours at one time to celebrate it. Uh, a lot of work went into it beforehand, and probably had the most people participating in any one event in the time I've lived in Leisure World. Uh, then I think that probably the, uh, the other things I think are like the historical society is, is exemplified by what you're doing right now, collecting the the history of our community. Those are that's another I think very very major uh, accomplishment we've had in the last few years. Yes, uh, I agree with you. I, uh, people don't do enough for the historical society. They probably think we sit in a hole someplace, but years from now uh, this will be appreciated. I, I think you're right. Um, oh, well, you have something big coming up that you, you'll be able to brag about, the 40th. 40th celebration. Right. And that, that, that we're just starting to plan that now, and it comes comes in next June. Uh, we are looking forward to the whole community taking part in that again. And I think I think it will be a major event. It's probably the first parade that these worlds had in about 25 years. Mm -hmm. Well, I know we'll all work together with you, and it'll be a supreme success. Um, one more question. What do you perceive in the future as uh, for Leisure World? Well, I think we're at a crossroads today. I think that very shortly all the loans will be paid off. And we're, we have, the community has expanded in the last several years. We've ex let people expand their apartments. And, and, and we now have a spread of, of units selling for 50,000, units selling for almost 300,000. 
and that's certainly a much wider spread than there was when the community was established 40 years ago. So I think it's going to be a challenge that we'll have to work our way through to how, how the development in the future uh, the community does support both of the, these kinds of homes, but I'm sure we have the talent to make it happen. Good. Well, I give you my thanks again, and uh, I wish you a lot of success in your future too, Tom. Thank You're you very much. You're doing a magnificent job, by the way. Thank you very much, and thank you for doing this project. <laughs> okay, thanks. That's it. Okay. Good.